What's up you guys, it's Hills for Techies here, and today I'm going to show you how to motion track in Motion 5. So basically this is what we're going to do. This is just a sample video I did just for basic motion tracking demo purposes. And so this is how it's going to look after we're done. So you see it, look, it seems like I have a hole in my wall. And you can see that as I move the camera. This hole right here moves with it as well. So that's it. That's basically the tutorial. It looks, it could look like it's something hard to do, but trust me, it's not that hard to do. So first, what you want to do is open motion. After you've opened motion, you want to click motion project right here. And for duration, we're just going to do 10 minutes. And you can do 60 frames per second. And for preset, we're going to do Broadcast HD 1080. So now you can see that Motion 5 is open. And this will also work in Motion 4, but um, I just have Motion 5, so I just wanted to show you guys. And so now what you want to do is import, I'm going to import um, my files. But after you got your um, video open, you want to just insert a text or an object that you want to motion track and what I'm going to motion track is tutorials for techies the word and you can also resize it and stuff so now make sure you have tutorials for techies down here in the timeline clicked or whatever um, whatever layer that you want to motion track make sure you have it clicked and what you want to do now is click this little cog right here. Whoops. Sorry about that. What you want to do now is click this little cog right here. You want to do motion tracking and you want to do match move. After you click after you click match move, you want to click on inspector so that you're able to see um, what you what you want to motion track. And I put this little um, baby wipes in this in this cubby right here because it has a yellow top. And I figured that since it has a yellow top, it'll be really easy to motion track on the orange background. So now that you have this little crosshair point selected on a color that's different from the background, so that it's easier to motion track, you want to you see movement right here. You want to click analyze. This may take some time, but it'll look cool in the end. Okay, so once the analyzing is complete at 100%, you can click on the project layer, and you want to go all the way back. Oops. You want to go all the way back in your timeline to the beginning. Oops. You want to go to the beginning of the clip. And once you go to the beginning of the, once you go to the beginning of the clip, you can press play, and you can see that once you press play, that the tutorials for techies or whatever object you have is motion tracked to that video file. This is great. A lot of like professionals use this idea, and um, you should really get used to it if you do have motion software. Um, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe to my videos, and I would love to have you guys comment so that I have ideas for future videos. Alright, thanks for watching. Peace.